Hello everyone, how are you all? Hope you all are doing well at your place. I am Shweta and welcome to the maths class of standard 3. I am teaching chapter number 10 measures of length and this is video number 3 of this chapter. Children, in the previous video I already have taught you how to add different units of length. In this video I will teach you how to solve a statement sum. Okay, so should we start with that? So as you can see, I have written here one question. Sohan Lal painted 25 meter 80 centimeter of the fence. Okay, Sohan Lal is a man who has painted 25 meter and 80 centimeter of the fence. When? Before lunch break. Okay. So, before lunch break, he has painted 25 meter and 80 centimeter of the fence. Okay. Now, and 8 meter and 28 centimeter after lunch. After the lunch break, he has painted 8 meter and 28 centimeter. Okay. So, now we have to find out how many fence did he paint together. Okay. In one day, how many Fence did he paint together before lunch break and after the lunch break. Okay. So, here we will write first statement we will write length of the fence he painted before lunch break. Okay. We will write here length of the fence he painted. Before lunch. Okay. Is equal to what we have to do here. First we have to make two columns. Okay. As you can see here two different units are there. Meter and centimeter. So first we will write here meter and here centimeter. Okay. In meter column we will write 25 meter. Okay, and in centimeter we will write 80 centimeter. So, this is the first statement. Okay, now we have to write the second statement that is length of the fence he painted. After lunch. Okay. After lunch how much length he has painted? He painted 8 meter and 28 centimeter. So under the column of meter we will write 8 meter. Okay. And in this place we have to give 0. Because 8 is 1 digit number. So 1 digit number means at 1's place we have to write. Now, here in centimeter, we have to write 28 centimeter. So, we will write here 28. Now, the third statement we have to write. Total length of the fence. Total length of the fence is equal to. Okay. Now, this we have to find out. Okay. Now we have to add these numbers. 8 plus 0 is equal to 8. 8 plus 2 is equal to 10. So in this 10 we have to write this 0 here. We cannot write 10 here because I already have told you that in centimeter column we can write up to only two digit number. So now these are two digit number. So this one will carry over to this place. Okay. Now, 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. 6 plus 8 is equal to 14. So, from this 14, we have to write 4 here. Okay? And this 1 will carry over to this place. Now, 2 plus 1, 3. Plus 0, 3. So, now we got the total length of the fence is equal to 34 meter and 8 centimeter he painted. So, the final statement we will write. Thus, 
टोटल लेंथ ही पेंटेड ऑल टूगेदर इज इक्वल टू थर्टी फोर मीटर एंड एट सेंटीमीटर I hope this is clear to you how to solve the statement sum. So just pause this video and write these example in your maths notebook. Okay, children, to clear your concept here, I have taken one more question. Okay, I have written here a plant was fifty five centimeter when planted. Means when it was planted. Okay, means someone has gone to the market and purchased a plant, and now he is planting that plant in his garden. So it was fifty five centimeter in length when the person has planted that plant in his garden. Okay. Now it has grown one meter eleven centimeter. After planting, it has grown one meter and eleven centimeter. Means one meter and eleven centimeter more. Okay, it has grown now. So now we have to find out how tall is the plant now. Okay, this is not the, the this is not the current length of the plant. Here it is describing that after planting, the plant has grown one meter eleven centimeter more. Okay, suppose this is the plant. Okay, and when planted, the height of this plant is fifty five centimeter. If I will just measure this, this is fifty five centimeter long. Okay, up to fifty five, we have to check. Means when it it has planted, the height of the plant was fifty five centimeter long. But now the plant has grown one meter eleven centimeter more. Means one meter and eleven centimeter. One meter is equal to hundred centimeter. Means we have to check one hundred and eleven centimeter up to here. Means more than this is not the current height of the plant. It has grown one meter eleven centimeter more, okay, in that garden. So now we have to find out what is the height of the plant right now, okay. So here what we have to do, we here we have to add these two lengths because this is the length when the plant was planted. Now we have to add this length, okay, to find out the current length of the plant. So the first statement we have to write is. length of the plant length of the plant when planted is equal to okay now here we can see the length was only 55 cm okay but in the second number here we can see meter and centimeter both units are there so here we have to make two columns meter and centimeter okay so when it was planted it was only of the length of 55 cm so here in the centimeter we have to write 55 and in meter we have to write 0 okay now the second statement we have to write length plant has grown okay length plant has grown is equal to 1 meter and 11 cm under the column of meter we will write 1 and under the column of centimeter we will write 11 now we have to give the addition sign now the third statement we have to write total length of the plant total length of the plant okay in this we have to just add these two numbers so 5 plus 1 is equal to 6 5 plus 1 is equal to 6 now 1 plus 0 is equal to 1 So the total length of the plant is equal to one meter and sixty-six centimeter. 
So, in the final statement, we can write, thus, the plant is one meter and sixty six centimeter tall. Understood now? I hope this is clear to you. Just pause this video and write this example also in your maths notebook.